Good morning guys, how are you doing? I'm starting my day with some uh, milk duds um, made with chocolate and caramel, but they are actually gluten free, which is pretty exciting. Um, so excuse me while I eat. So Jenkins Shelter just behind me at 578.8 miles. And I'm heading to First Gulf to get 600 miles and then heading on to Jenny Knob Shelter, which is 602. Plan for the day, 10 to 8 in the morning. Let's get moving. Just so you know, we are in Hunting Camp Creek Wilderness. We are just on VA615, so we've walked about five miles this morning, which is pretty good, really nice terrain, not too bad. Just had a little bit of a protein bar, restocked my water, and now let us carry on the journey. Hey guys, so I'm just on this very nice, well, not that nice gravel road for a half a mile section. How pretty are those for you? So that is, that is the way that I have come from. I just come out down this road, so I've got about half a mile down this road, and then we'll see where we end up. I'm sure this is meant for me. Go, baby, go! Woo! Hey guys, so I've just made it to Bush Mountain Outpost. So I've ordered myself a BLT. I've got a Coke. I'm just gonna have a little mini break before I start the next section. But the weather is absolutely glorious, so this is awesome. So the one really weird thing when you're walking on a road, when you're meant to be on the Appalachian Trail, is you're really scared that you're going to miss the turning and end up getting lost. So it's amazing when you end up seeing, I don't know if you can see on that tree, you can see like the white blaze. So you do know you are going in the right direction, but I get really like paranoid, like, oh God, what if I miss it? What if I miss the turning? What if it's not obvious? And then I end up spending, you know, half an hour to an hour walking, trying to find where I should be. So this is when you have to pay attention and really focus. Okay, let's find the trail. Okay, folks, we are back on the trail. I can relax, I can see the white blazers, but we're also going uphill again, which is always fun. You know how I like the uphills. Oh. Right guys, Helvey's Mill Shelter is 0.3 miles that way, but uh, we are not going there. So that means we are currently at 592.3 miles. The next section is 6.6 .6 miles. This is a pretty big one. It's all sort of gravel, but it is downhill. So let's just crack on and bash out the mileage. Woo! guys I'm so happy right now I couldn't tell how far I'd walked and then I've just come across this sign oh, 600 600 flipping miles oh my goodness 600 miles that is insane guys we've made it 600 miles Woo Hey guys, so since we last spoke at the 600 mile mark, I've just been pushing on really quite hard because the next shelter is at 602.3 and I just really, really want to get there. The sooner I get there, I can start the recovery process and I think I'll get there pretty early if I can just continue this pace for the next 20 minutes, 30 minutes or so. But fingers crossed we get to the shelter soon. Woo! 
guys, this is the sign I wanted to see. Shelter this way. Oh my god, amazing. Oh, I'm so happy right now. Yay, shelter, shelter, shelter. Come on, let's get there. Let's get some water. Let's eat some food. Let's take my shoes off. Let's take my backpack off. Oh, let's start the recovery process. Come on. Woo! Made it, guys. Absolutely awesome. We're at the shelter. The time is 5.30. That has to be the earliest I've made it to a shelter ever. Oh my God, because normally I get here and then I've got to carry on and do another like six miles. So this is super exciting, such an amazing day. I'll update you in a little bit once I've had water and eaten and refreshed. Guys, I've rocked up to the shelter. Guys, I've rocked up to the shelter. This is John. Hello. And John has been an absolute legend and he's given me some food and it's warm and it's cooked. And let me show you. Oh yeah, that looks good. What, what are we eating again? We... Chicken Alfredo. Chicken Alfredo. Could this day get any better? Oh my God, I got to the shelter at like 5.30. I had a lovely lunch and now I'm having dinner. Oh, this is epic. Guys, this is just such a novel experience. I don't actually know what to do with myself when I'm not walking. But let me show you my setup. So I've got my uh, my Thermarest Air all blown up. I've got my amazing Raid Light sleeping bag. I've got my little jacket hung up here, my shoes, my warm clothing. And then I've got my backpack hung up here. Um, which has got like a little mouse protector thing in. So pretty much I'm all ready for bed. And I'm thinking I'm gonna get into bed and start resting and recovering. But thank you so much for watching these videos. I really appreciate it. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure that you subscribe. And big thank you to Flynn as well for doing an incredible job with the editing. All the links that you could possibly need are down below. So please do go check them out. Otherwise, catch you tomorrow. Have a wonderful evening, whatever it is that you are doing. And I'll speak to you soon. Lots of love. Bye.